Hello guys, I'm Dr. Nyedika of Quebec Healthcare Academy. Today I want to expose you to another amazing diagnostic and therapeutic device called the Meta Hunter, the Meta Hunter Nonlinear System Analyzer. Meta Hunter Nonlinear System Analyzer. Okay, uh, we have a um, different series of um, NLS device. We have the there are two major series. We have the, um, the the 3D upgraded to 9D upgraded to 17D series. Then we have the Hunter series that started from Oberon to, Me to Megatron to Metatron. And what we call the Meta Hunter. Okay, we had the Hunter, then the Meta Hunter. Okay. And um, that's what I want to expose you to. You may be familiar with the 17D, both a diagnostic and a treatment equipment. But the Meta Hunter has a special feature that makes treatment faster with that device. And that is why uh, the price is probably three times the price of the regular 9D, 17D NLS device. The Meta Hunter. All right, based on his major feature, it was named Hunter because uh, it makes symptoms disappear faster. Why? Because of its special treatment features that it has. It has a special treatment feature. And this treatment is carried out on eight levels. Treatment with the Meta Hunter is carried out on eight levels. The first is on the molecule. And then on the ultra structure, then on the DNA helix, then on the chromosomes, then on the nucleus, then on the cell, then on the tissue, then to the entire organ. So you can imagine that once it starts its metatherapy treatment, look at all the eight levels of treatment that it will carry out. That is why treatment becomes faster. I have had testimonies of people who bought this machine from me and the God's amazing results. Someone used a metatherapy device and to uh, on, on her nephew, and within just a short period of doing metatherapy, a high temperature became normal after the treatment. All right. I personally, as I just acquired this device, I use this on a patient who has angina pectoris and also has heart block. And at night, he has always been complaining of um, severe pain in the chest, like someone that they are pursuing in the village. All right. I was using, I, when he came for day one for treatment, I used my 17 D NLS to do treatment for him. Uh, by night, I saw his chart. He said, the pain has come again. I can't sleep. The next day, I did it. But by the third day, Coincidentally, I just acquired this um, Meta Hunter device. I didn't get disturbed that night after I used it on him by the third day. The next day when he came for treatment, I was like, I didn't hear any news from you. How far? He said ah, that he didn't receive any uh, attack. That Then by daytime, he said that the pains has drastically reduced. Whatever machine you used on me, Yesterday, please continue to use it on me. I think it is working. That is the Meta Hunter device I'm talking about. All right. And I want to do a demonstration on how it treats. First of all, it starts by scanning. Once it scans a particular area and discovers an abnormal um, stress on an organ, it will switch to what we call 3D spiral scanning or what we call volumetric scanning. And that is where it will now start tracing the root cause of the disease down to the faulty molecule, faulty DNA helix, faulty chromosome, faulty nucleus, faulty cell, faulty tissue. All right. And so that by it unearths all those problems, then when it's time for treatment, it, uh, it makes it easy to take care of. And so that is why treatment 
disappear faster with the Meta Hunter uh, device. So I'm going to do a demonstration on an organ. I may not be able to allow it go to uh, do automatic uh, spiral scanning because of time. So I will just select an organ and manually do the hunting for you to see. Let me just select this organ. Okay. Then uh, I do a scan. Okay. Scanning is ongoing on the Sagaita Toraxotomy. All right. Okay. I wish I had a 5, a level 5 or a level 6. That would have been easy for me to explain what I want to explain. But I'm going to pick this. If you are familiar with the, just follow the cursor. If you are familiar with the, um, um, how to interpret um, the NLS results, I am trying to do analysis on the visual method, visual method of analysis, all right? And we have symbols. We know that the NLS device interprets results using frequencies, numbers, pictures, colors, and symbols, all right? So this triangle facing down is called a level four, or what we call a stage four, all right? Abnormal um, stress on an organ will be a level five or a level six. So let me use this um, level four, and I want to hunt it. Let me pretend that there's a stress there, there's a problem going on there, okay? And I want to switch, I want to hunt the root cause. So I want you to watch this image, watch this cursor. I bring it down here, okay? Can you see the image here? What is reflecting there? The aorta. All right. Assuming there was a five here, assuming there's a level five here, it's going to hunt it down. Let us trace where, which organ is being affected here. All right. So it is at this level. It's going to trace to the molecule. It's going to scan the molecule. It's going to study the molecule. It's going to study the ultra structure of this. It's going to study the DNA helix, it's going to study the chromosomes, it's going to study the nucleus and the tissue. All right. Then I can now select any of these eight uh, options that I, bring, uh, I mentioned and decide to do metatherapy treatment directly on either the molecule, the ultra structure, the DNA helix, the chromosomes, the nucleus, or the tissue. Okay. Uh, um, the most common is the tissue. They are, they are directly treating the affected tissue. When you treat the affected tissue directly, then it makes symptoms appear faster. So I'm going to hunt this. So it's scanning the outer. It is scanning the outer. All right. So I go back down to the outer. Can you see? Now I have a level 6. I have a level 6. Implying that there is something going on there. Okay? If I even wanted to do further um, analysis, like the CSS analysis, I can even come here, go to analysis, go to test standard, um, let me say, check pathomorphology to see what is going on there. Um, adjustment, adjust all, okay. So, and we have a um, idiopathic hypertension there, all right. We want to run the vehicle test to see whether it is strengthening or weakening, okay. So, uh, you can see that's am another amazing thing with this one. The moment it does the vehicle test, it prompts you directly to uh, go to comparative analysis to check the result. It generates the result for you immediately. You don't have to start um, going here and here. you can see. It is saying weakening compensatory reaction, 22%. Okay. So this person I am scanning is 
having issues with idiopathic hypertension. Idiopathic hypertension is talking about um, um, high blood pressure. All right, it's a, it has to do with high blood pressure um, going on in that particular tissue. All right. So now, if I want to still do further hunting. All right, to this is a tissue. Maybe I want to go down to, um, uh, let me see, let me pick this particular one. Okay, you can see I picked one and it is giving me a brought out histological session of the blood cell. Now I want to go for that to um, study the blood cell where another problem is. Okay. Now, I pick this one, you can see erythrocytes. There is a level 6 on the erythrocytes. Let me pick that and do a scanning. So you see how we keep narrowing it down, keep hunting until you get to where the problem is. Okay, now I have the erythrocytes. All right, so if I want to analyze the, so if, I'm dealing with um, idiopathic hypertension and I want it to disappear. I start treatment from this particular cytological um, preparation. So let me do metatherapy on this. I'll just do it once. Okay. You can see. Can you see it is already reversing? A six has changed to a four. Good. So you can repeat it like that for a couple of times. But now I want to have done treatment on the on the uh, erythrocyte. Now I want to go back to uh, the blood cell, do treatment on the meta uh, on the on the blood cell. I do treatment on the blood cell. Okay, so you do it a, a number of times. Then I now go back to um, the aorta, the tissue I'm dealing with, and do metatherapy on it. So you do this, you can see they are changing. The numbers are reducing from a 6 to a 4, like that, until you do it a number of times until you bring it to a 1, 2, and 3. Okay, so for the sake of this video, I will just do this once. So I have treated the tissue. I can't go through all the eight levels of treatment. All right, so I just did about three or four now. Okay, now let me take it back to the organ and do treatment on the organ. All right, so imagine that I, I, I hunt and do treatment like this. That is how symptoms disappear faster with the Meta Hunter device when you use this on your patient. Okay, so I just wanted to expose this amazing feature, and practically speaking, I get results. Symptoms disappear faster. So, what I'm trying to say in, es in, in essence is that um, what may take you about 10 sessions with your 9D, with your 17 GNLS device may eventually take maybe about 5 sessions because of this special feature called the volumetric scanning that gives you opportunity to scan and do treatment on these 8 levels of the human body. The, um, the molecules, the ultrastructure, the DNA, the chromosomes, the nucleus, the tissue and the entire organ. Symptoms appear faster that way. All right. So I encourage you to come on board to upgrade your device to start using the Meta Hunter device. And if you want to order for it, you can reach me. All right. Our program that teaches on diagnosis and um, our next program that will be training on diagnostic and therapeutic equipment will be. Uh, coming up on the 24th to 29th of October. If you want to learn more on these equipment, you, I encourage you to uh, enroll for this training and you will not regret it. Meanwhile, 
um, because of this uh, impression I had inside of me to just do this exposition on this Meta Hunter, I'm going to create a small group for those of you that have bought the Meta Hunter before now and may not have been maximizing the, the potential of this device. Uh, just, I'm going to create a small group and I'm going to do a refresh training for every one of you for a very small amount of money. I'm going to create a link very soon and I will put it out and will fix a date within the next one or two weeks and so that you will start maximizing this device. And any other person that wants to be a part of that short uh, refresh training, although please take note, I will not be answering any questions that is outside uh, Meta Hunter. If you are bringing questions on uh, NLS, probably because you have not learned or you've not been trained on that, I may not entertain some questions. I'll be entertaining questions on Meta Hunter when I create that group. So watch out for the link when I'll drop it. Thank you.